playing with nukes. It's so much fun to play with nukes. Do 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 do. All right, so ladies and gentlemen, tonight I'm playing Minecraft, and I apologize because I'm very under the weather. I've been very sick for the past two days. I only got the ability to talk back earlier today. My throat is still swollen. My head is still massively congested. My head feels like it's swollen. I've got a big headache right up here, all throughout behind my right eye, into my ear. Okay, all pressure, head pressure. So I can only talk like this. I can't really be myself, and I apologize, but... <clears throat> I said that tonight I would do some Minecraft because it's more laid back, it's more chill, and it doesn't require me to really do, uh, even though there's a lot of talking, it's not a ton of like, oh my god, yelling or screaming or anything like that. Oh no! Oh no! 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 Papa Vera! Oh, fucking shit! And it's a lot more interactive when you guys, uh, you know, interact with me on stream. It's a lot better than, say, a stream where I have to, like, hyper-focus on, on reading or commenting on, on a multiplayer gameplay or whatever. So anyway, I just loaded it, and if you remember where we left off, I was underground mining. And I just loaded the game, and look what just happened. I literally loaded the game. I was supposed to be underground. Instead, I fell out of the sky and smashed and died. It makes absolutely no sense what just happened. How does that even make sense? It makes no fucking sense at all, right? It makes zero sense. How does that make any sense? Zero. I have no idea where I am. I have no idea what just happened. It spawned me in the sky and killed me. And I have no idea what I'm supposed to do here. Uh. <coughs> this is not good. <clears throat> So, I have no idea what happened. I don't know where my items are. At all. You know, I, I don't know what's going on. So, I lost all my inventory. It was showing an island in the rain with, with a sheet. Maybe it's my original spawn point over here. Maybe that's where all my stuff is. Yeah, it looks like it. <sighs> So for absolutely no explainable reason, the game, instead of spawning me underground where I was set up for a mining expedition, spawned me on my original spawn point, dropping me into the, the middle of a the sky, then dropping me onto the ground and killing me, making me lose all of my items and experience. Because as you can see now, I had 30 experience and now I only have 7. Even though I did absolutely nothing wrong. Because <clears throat> this whole thing that had nothing to do with me and me doing nothing wrong. This is not the experience I wanted to have playing Minecraft starting out tonight, and I'm going to be honest, this is fucking horseshit. And the fact that Microsoft bought this game and apparently made it worse <laughs> is pretty disappointing. Like, what the fuck were they thinking? What did they do? They fucked the game up. I mean, am I wrong? <clears throat> I can't imagine people who play this game long term liking it then. I mean, wouldn't you be incredibly frustrated if... At any moment, you could save your game and load and then just die instantly. It doesn't even make sense, right? So, I had level... No lie. I had, like, like level 27, 28, and I'm down to level 7 experience because the game fucked up. I did nothing wrong at all. <laughs> what the hell? I mean... That's really sad. <sighs> Super Bad Cat resell for the 22nd month in a row and ask am I feeling better? No. I can st I can talk, but I still feel like shit. I do. I feel awful. <clears throat> the paradox said, "Owner, bitch, and I'm good to feel today. How are you? I'm I'm still suffering from this damn cold. <laughs> <clears throat> As you can hear, <clears throat> it's very annoying. Um, but it is what it is. Thank you for asking. But you know, being away for two days with no streams is not a good idea. When I need to raise money to pay my bills in less than a week. So I have to be here as much as I can, even though th Friday I have to be off. So <laughs> things are just not working out so well for me recently. I'm <laughs> just being honest here. They're just not. Um, 
But there's not much I could do about it. I guess I'm just gonna be screwed for, for January and not pay any of my bills or something. I don't know. I don't know what else to do anymore. At the end of the month, I need to somehow raise enough money to pay this guy so he'll do my, my taxes for me. Um, if I don't do this, I'm in very, very dire straits. If you don't file your taxes, you could go to jail. All right? And I don't want to go to jail, but I need to be able to afford to file my taxes. So that's why I'm doing this special event on the 28th of February. My re The recommendation that someone... Uh, told me was that instead of enchanting the way I've been enchanting, which is, what the? Where'd you guys come from? What the hell? Uh, Cody Carl's Charity said, what would you do the morning after drinking a lot during your old YouTube videos? The morning after, the morning after drinking a lot? Um, I would sleep in. Like, my old YouTube stuff, I almost never did anything early in the morning unless it was a new release. Um, yeah, I do sound like shit, Emer Park. I know I do. I feel like shit, too. I feel awful. Ugh. Oh, what is this? The fuck is diorite? Uh, gravel, flint. No, no flint there. I'm trying to consolidate what I can. Amazing gameplay. Oh, yeah, Mash Labrador did a 100-bit cheer. He says, I read on Twitter, you and Kat got to go to an Italian restaurant on Christmas Eve. Great, hopefully it was good. No, that didn't happen at all. If you really want to know the truth, we went out to a local fast food Chinese place because I was feeling, like, terribly like shit. And even though we were originally planning on maybe going somewhere nicer, we just went to the closest place possible, and we got fast food Chinese. And that's what we did for Christmas Eve. <clears throat> and we came right home. Because <clears throat> I felt awful. Jackie Spurs says, would it be possible to take a week to recoup? Well, considering right now I don't have enough money to pay my bills the first week of January, and I don't receive payment from Twitch until the middle of the month, uh, I'd say no. I'd say I have to be here to work and raise money, or else I can't pay my bills. You know? Just being honest and real here, if I don't pay my bills, uh, I won't have internet. I might, you know, or, you know I won't have uh, anything. I have to work. So, I need th that money. I really do. I need that money to pay my bills, the electric bill, the internet bill, and the incredible amount of games, new games. I'm pretty sure Alucard Ali that drinking more beer would not fix my throat. Although drinking beer is not what screwed up my throat to begin with. Beer does not make your throat fuck up. No, I, I honestly, if you want my honest opinion, what I really think happened was... It's a combination of overworking my, the hell out of myself these past couple of weeks. As you know, I streamed nine straight days without a break. Um, then took a day off when I all I did was run around and do things and was busy all day. Didn't really relax. Then came back for my incredibly busy holiday weekend with all my special events and everything. <clears throat> so I think I overworked myself way too much. And then... Basically, during the holiday events, as you guys know, I basically kind of got really worried because there weren't a lot of contributions coming in, and I was kind of counting on my holiday stuff to do really well. As I told you guys, I don't even, I mean, not, no exaggeration, I don't have enough money right now to pay my bills in January at all, and I don't really know what to do. So when, when it was, like, really slow, I was playing, you know, especially this Sunday, I was doing Street Fighter and stuff, and nothing was coming in. People were complaining it's boring. I was like, this is not good, like... I'm really fucking nervous. So basically, I think what happened is, you know the term sick with worry? I think that's what it is. I was drinking while I was overstressed, and I just got sick with worry about shit going on, and I let myself get sick. I think that's honestly what happened. So the bottom line is that nothing is really consistent. Okay? It's not. Um, And it makes me very, very nervous. You know? You know, it's, it's been a very tough year for me. It's been a great year, but financially, it's been a very tough year for me. Where a lot of things have just been completely out of my control that kind of screwed me over. I'm not going to talk about it tonight because we're going to talk about this on the podcast. It's one of the major segments of the podcast. It's going to be me talking about this year, how things went, and, you know, comparing um, the quality of the product that I put out versus, you know, me financially, how it, how it went. Right? Because they're two, honestly, they're two completely different things. So I'm going to talk about that on the podcast. I really don't want to talk about it all night tonight. I just don't. I just want to chill with you guys, you know? But I think that's what it was. Like, I got really just sick with 
worrying about the future and I got all worked up and you know I felt awful I I did I felt mentally I was really just feeling terrible and allowed myself to um by the way this is earlier on this is where I used to I was grabbing the diamond from earlier on yeah it is this is where I already mined diamond from the first diamond I had found um but yeah basically you know I, I got myself all worked up and worried to the point where I actually got sick because of it. And, you know, I was really looking forward to Christmas because this is the first Christmas I ever spent with Kat. And I was hoping was, even though things had gone kind of poorly on the holiday stream on Sunday, that the, the Christmas Eve podcast would make up for it on Monday. And then I would be able to relax with Kat during Christmas Day on Tuesday and have a good first ever holiday with her. And then kind of come back strong. And sadly, it didn't happen, as you guys know. I ended up getting so damn sick. I felt awful. And uh, I wasn't even able to stream, you know, Christmas Eve, Christmas Day. I had no voice. <sighs> so really bad. You know, it sucks. <clears throat> this fucking sucks. It's just life. It happens. Here's how I go back here. Um, <clears throat> you know, and it's, it stinks. But... You know, it is what it is. That's life, I guess. And all I can do is move forward positively. You know, tomorrow I am going to hopefully do the podcast, even though I'm going to sound terrible. Hopefully the podcast will go well. I guess we'll see. Remains to be seen, right, how it's going to go. And then, you know, put forward more more streams by the end of the month, and hopefully I can raise money to pay bills. And if I can't, what else can I do, right? I don't even know what else to say about it. Like, it's not, I don't even think it's really worth talking about because if I don't raise enough money, I don't raise enough money, I guess I get into trouble. <laughs> what else can I say? Well, guess what? If I can't file my taxes, I can't pay my taxes, I go to jail, and I can't stream. So if you don't see the benefit of avoiding that, again, I can't help you. You're an idiot. If you're that dumb, I can't help you. I mean, really, if you're really that fucking brain dead stupid. I love doing celebratory goals. I love doing rewards. But I'm in a situation right now where life has jumped into the situation and said, sorry, you need to do something different than usual because this is coming up. So either I handle it or I don't. If I ignore it and I go to jail for not paying my taxes, I can't stream, dumbass. So how about you grow the fuck up and grow a brain? You are a dumbass. The Indie Glow says, that's why a cold is called a dis-ease. It's a stress buildup. I hear you, man. All right, so some people have suggested I change my skin. I have no idea how to do this. What the fuck? These are locked. Wow. So I changed from a, a red-headed woman to a black kid. Okay. <clears throat> I'm a black kid now. All right. <clears throat> now I'm getting out of here. Xbox One is garbage. Shipped me a dollar and said, it took me five minutes to type my name. I'm still here. <clears throat> my 30 second shot of vodka. I find that hard to believe because you'd probably be dead. <clears throat> I don't know why people, <clears throat> why this is a meme. Or who made up that stupid meme. Because Ferrero Rocher is not expensive candy at all. So I don't understand why people think it is. Unless you just listen to some dumbass who made a meme out of it. <laughs> Alright, I think it's time to save up. It was an okay session. I apologize I can't go later, guys. But like you hear, I sound terrible. And I do want to relax now. So thanks for at least stopping by tonight, even though I sound like shit. Hopefully tomorrow I'll be better and every day I'll be dramatically better. We'll see, I guess, right? Okay. Oh no! Oh no! 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 Papa Vera! Oh, fucking shit!